Good morning, everybody. This is Keith Mills with On Time Construction Consulting. This is the kitchen in our Maitland custom home as we finish everything up here. So shot this whenever it's still dark outside, so you really get the dramatic effect of all the light that's in here. So as you can see, we've added lots of different accent lighting. We've got the under cabinet lighting, which lights down on the countertop, so it actually works well for whenever you're working on the countertops. So we've also got some toe kick lighting, so down underneath. This obviously cool effect, as you can see in the video, love it. So also I'm gonna show you, we'll turn off the lights here in a second, and actually will acts as a great night light is what it does. So this is our oversized island. So we've got a sink here. So we've also got another sink behind me, which I'll show you here in a second. So cabinets and storage of trash on this end, sorry, uh, yeah, trash on this end down here. So we've got a stack of drawers on that end, disposal on this. We finished everything out with panels the whole way around. So and then we've got more storage on this side underneath the overhang. So there's actually another set of uh, base cabinets right in there. So as you see, we've got an overhang on this countertop, which looks awesome. Place to be able to slide chairs up underneath though, so to get more seating out here. And we did something different here where we actually created a table. So out of the cabinet and the countertop material. So this is literally gonna be their table that they eat at. You can put multiple chairs, you get two there, one here, if you wanna put one on the end and two more on the side. So you can actually seat five people. So at this piece and another three to four at the island. Um, tons of seating space in here and without having a formal dining room. So this does still create what you're looking for. So you've got the uh, Advantium oven. So, and a regular oven. So set up here, you got the refrigerator, of course. So you've got a gas cooktop, so that we've got in here. So a hood to go ahead and take care of everything. All these cabinets are custom cabinets. You can see the detail that's involved. So if you see things like the light rail, this is what hides the tape lighting that's underneath, that's down lighting everything. So it gives it a more finished look and appearance. So all the way up to the crown, this is 42 inch upper cabinets. So that we've got in here, of course. So they went with the matte black on all of the finishes as far as the pools go. Uh, so it looks great. So this really looks good. Uh, pendant lights over top of the island and everything. So we're gonna go ahead and do a little bit of uh, knocking out some lighting so you can see what things look like without some of the lights on. So that's without the recessed lights on. So those are your pendants right there. So that's what we've got. I'm gonna kick the low volt lighting down so you can see what the pendant lighting actually does. So here's our pendant lighting. So over top, so still tons of light. So even whenever you've just got those pendants on, so over top of your island. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn that on. I'll show you the, what it looks like without any other lighting on. So this is what I was talking about with the low volt lighting. So now we've got these on dimmer control, so they don't have to be necessarily as, whoops, sorry, wrong side. So um, whenever we've got this, so everything's all nice and bright, as you can see. So you literally would have to have nothing else on it, and you have plenty of light in this kitchen. Uh, to be able to come in in the evening without a challenge, leave that on whenever you walk out the door and you've got some light on in here whenever you come in. So we'll flip the lighting around and go to the under cabinets. So same thing for the under cabinet lighting. So tons of lighting uh, on that for workspace lighting. There's so many different lighting options in here, which is the great part about this uh, kitchen. So in the way it was designed, it's always nice doing new construction pieces like this because you really get to do um, some fancy features and homeowners that love to go ahead and add a little pizzazz uh, with some of the things that they've gone ahead and done in here. 